the basic terms in division are dividend divisor quotient and remainder dividend is the number to be divided divisor is the number by which dividend is divided quotient is the result obtained by the process of division and remainder is the number left in last by the process of division let's learn these terms by doing examples let's divide 2934 with 9 first we should arrange the number like this then in this number the first digit is 2 which is less than 9 less than the divisor so consider the next number also then our number of consideration will be 29 divide 29 with 9 use multiplication table of 9 just write multiplication table over here 19 is 9 2 nines are 18 3 nines are 27 4 nines are 36 5 nines are 45 6 nines are 54 so divide 29 with 9 4 nines are 36 but our consideration is just 29 so take the previous multiplication 3 nines are so write 3 over here then multiply with the 3 with 9 3 nines are 27 then subtract 27 from 29 we will get 2 then bring down this 3 then number of consideration will be 23 then again use multiplication table of 9 which is the multiplication this one 2 nines are 18 3 nines are 27 no need to go up to this so just take the previous 2 nines are 18 write 2 over here 2 into 9 2 nines are 18 then again subtract we will get 5 then bring down this 4 then then our number of consideration is 54 then use the multiplication table again 6 nines are 54 write 6 over here multiply the 6 with 9 6 nines are 54 again subtract we will get 0 so our process completed this is the remainder uh, in this the remainder is 0 and the answer is known as quotient and the number to be divided is dividend and the number by which dividend is divided is divisor okay 5542 divided by 15 this time divisor is a two digit number as i said before 5 is less than 15 so consider 55 55 divided by 15 you may not have studied multiplication table of 15 so just do some multiplication with some nearby numbers to find out the closest match i mean to find out how many times 55 contains 15 if we do 15 into 4 it will be 60 more than 55 so take the previous multiplication 15 into 3 it will be 45 so right 3 over here 315 is 45 subtract we will get 10 then bring down 4 number of consideration is 104 104 4, 1 or 4 divided by 15 again do some multiplication if we do 15 into 7 it will be 105 more than 104 so do the previous one that is 15 into 6 that is 90 6 15 is 90 subtract we will get 14 then bring down 2 our number of consideration is 142 then just find out some multiplication of 15 into 8 it will be 120 Just try another one. Fifteen into nine, it will be one thirty-five. If we do fifteen into ten, it is one fifty, which is more than one forty-two. So take fifteen into nine. Right, nine nine into fifteen is one thirty-five. 
subtract we will get 7 7 is what 7 is the remainder and quotient is 369 divisor is 15 and the dividend is 5542 let's do division with 10 100 and 1000 in order to divide with these numbers there is a pattern if we divide with 10 the one digit will be the remainder one digit will be remainder and rest of number will be quotient and if we divide with 100 the number from 10th position onwards will be the remainder rest of number will be quotient and if we divide with 1000 number from 100th position will be remainder rest of number will be the quotient that means if we divide 456 divided by 10 the one digit 6 will be the remainder and the rest of the number 45 will be the quotient similarly if we divide 7583 divided by 100 number from 10th position onwards that is 83 83 will be the remainder and 75 will be the quotient and if we divide 48,620 divided by 1000, what will be the remainder? The number from 100th position, 6 is the 100th position. So, number from 100th position, 620, 620 will be the remainder and 48 will be the quotient. Let's do division of 48,000. 620 divided by 1000. Let's check whether it will be 48 and remainder as 620. First, we should consider which number 4862 to divide. Four thousands are 4000. Subtract 2, 6, 8. Bring down 0. 8000s are 8000. Subtract. C. 620 is the remainder. And 48 is the answer. Very simple. That's all about the topic. Please do like, comment, share and subscribe my channel Knowledge Masters. If this video is helpful for you.